<laughs> oh, guys and girls, look at that. Look at that. That's just gonna be fantastic. Hey up peeps, here we are back in the wife's sewing room. And uh, what we've got to do is we've got to get this display in Raspberry Pi here, which we've thoroughly tested, as you'll have seen in the uh, previous videos, into this wooden box. I've marked out where I want the display to sit on the box. So this is the front, this will be hollowed out, and that will go down in there something like that. But uh, from that side to that side, is quite thick so I think we've got to we've got to hollow this out a little bit more um, go a little bit uh, thinner with it the viewing area of this screen here um, is 11 centimeters across there by six and a half centimeters down there so yeah there's other stuff going on anyway um, yeah it's uh, time to get back out to the shed and uh, start chopping up some wood the snowman's almost gone well, oh, time to uh, time to open the shed. Okay then, so uh, just to give you a quick feel for this router. Uh, spinny blades right here, and uh, little fences, I suppose they're called, to uh, stop the wood from going too far in any specific direction. Um, and spinny blade makes uh, makes little little holes like this. So um, yeah, it's a, a handheld CNC machine. So I guess um, it's called a router because it routes tracks like that. So uh, yeah, that's looking a bit, uh, it's looking a bit better. Uh, we've taken probably two, maybe, maybe three millimeters uh, out of that. So we're going to go ahead and um, finish this up. I'm So you might notice that um, some of my fences are a little bit off and therefore we end up with this ridge here. Uh, there we go, you can see it a little clearly now if I... So yeah, we've got that ridge on two sides. So in order to compensate for that, what I'm gonna do, uh, this was the top front this way. I'm gonna spin it around, put it back on there. It's a messy old job, but uh, someone's got to do it. Right, so, there we go, that all looks uh, relatively clean in there now. A little bit of a, a knobby there, but that's going to come out when the screen is, uh, when the screen's chopped out. So, uh, cool, okay, uh, right. So, next part of the mission then, is uh, perhaps to drill some holes uh, close to the corners of where the screen's going to be so I can put um, a different router bit on here and, uh, and we can cut that lump out. Uh, what we'll probably have to do is move some of these fences around.
Okay, just changing the, uh, the router bit. Going with a slightly smaller, slightly thinner router bit. So, uh, uh, have I got that in the right way? Yeah, I think I have. Uh, let's give it a try. <laughs> that's um, that's still quite thick. I don't know if you can see the the depth of that, but uh, yeah, that's um, that's still pretty thick. Okay, so uh, we were ever so slightly off with our cut, but uh, I shouldn't let that bother us. Um, we're on target with this line here. Uh, we're on target with this line here. We're off with this line. There's a good few mil here, but we're on the right side of the line, so I'm happy with that. Uh, it did um, it did catch a little bit there and chuck some chuck some splinters out, but again. It's on the right side of the line, so we should be able to clean all that up. Looks a bit messy at the moment, but don't panic. I think we'll be okay. Righto peeps, I've done some pretty serious sounding and uh, please excuse the screen, it might look all very bubbly and shiny but that's because um, I've got the protective sticker on it still. The screen now fits in here, something like that and it looks absolutely spot on. Uh, it's a pretty much perfect, perfect fit. So um, I'll have to get that nailed down and there's still just enough room for small USB drives and stuff like that in here as well, which is a good news, happy days. So, um, without further ado, it's, uh, it's time to get a little linseed oil on this thing. Uh, give it a bit of a treatment. It, um, it's definitely gonna, it's gonna need some, some of this again in the future. But uh, I just want to, I just want to see, oh, ho, 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 yes, this is going to look magnificent. Oh, wow. Rory, Rory, this is your piece of wood, mate. You sent it to me all the way from Scotland, from Glasgow, from wee Glasgow, where I see you've also been having quite a bit of snow recently. But, um... Oh mate, this is going to be absolutely beautiful. <laughs> I can't wait. It's my birthday uh, very soon. And um, yeah, this is, uh, well, I expect this will probably end up being a present for the wife, won't it? But because um, she likes gaming more than I do. But yeah, oh, this is going to be magnificent. Oh boy, oh boy. 
Right, I know I'm going on, I'm sorry, but all the, all the hard work and, uh, and the results are starting to, starting to show now. This is really quite nice. and girls look at that look at that that's just gonna be fantastic I'm super stoked super excited that's gonna be a beauty cool 